careful down there, careful down there. I was in an international business class and our study abroad kind of program director came in and talked a little bit about South Africa and uh, I'd always wanted to do an abroad program and this one kind of just fit best into my schedule. And then how I ended up at GCU is we got a call from Nawal talking about different um, internships that we could do. Uh, and she said that GCU would be the one where we'd get to be the most like hands-on and get to work the most with the kids and with the online, social media and marketing, all the kind of stuff that I wanted to do and have a little bit more of an impact than just like your day-to-day -day intern. And I was looking at a ton of different programs and kind of deciding what I wanted to do and then all of a sudden Beyond Sports offered to do a program with Wittenberg. And so all of the pieces fell into place and I ended up here. Specifically with GCU, uh, to work with a program that kind of hits the nail on the head as far as everything that I'm passionate about. I'm an educational studies major so all of the education focused community development that GCU does is really important to me, something that I'm passionate about. And then also I'm a former soccer player, so being able to be involved with the soccer program, um, I actually played with the senior goal 50 team um, for quite a few games and that was a really awesome experience to you know get to play the, the sport that I love with people that are very different than me and, and get to know them through the, the lens of sport. So that's definitely something that I wanted is that hands-on experience and, and being able to actually make a difference in the program. It's really just like a privilege and an honor to be able to like experience just kind of like real people and just like realness of like the other side of Cape Town. Like like being here, if I didn't have that experience, I would love it just as much. But like just being with Mario and being with his family and being part of GCU just gives me a nice perspective of being like, okay, this is kind of like the reality of like the world and of Cape Town and it's nice to be involved in that. I've worked a lot with the after school curriculum, which has been fun. So I've gotten to know a lot of the tutors and they're all really awesome people from around Heidveld and they know the community and it's fun getting to talk to them because they also really get to see the change that it makes for the kids and they know exactly how much it means to the community that these children are getting this opportunity. The highlight with the kids would probably be playing on like the little like merry-go-round thing with like that spinny thing because um, they absolutely love it like they just they I think they could be on there all day and not get sick and I don't know how because I can be on there for five minutes and I'm like okay I'm ready to get off. <laughs> I think that GCU is a program that is doing a lot of really good things for the Heideveld community and I think specifically focusing on education is huge because that's kind of the key to a lot of social development and, and really kind of bridging the gaps that seem to exist. Well it's been a great experience there's there's so much to do here in Cape Town and there's a lot of city life but there's also a lot of nature. We've hiked people Mountain. Um, we've gone to Camps Bay, uh, Clifton, Musenberg. We've hiked uh, Devil's Peak. Just this last weekend, I got to do go surfing for the first time ever at Musenberg, which was really cool. And then the classes we've been taking have been really cool too. We did a history of South Africa. But also just kind of like the history part, and just be able to have like that experience, like go to the, the Slave Museum, go to the District Six Museum. Our South African history teacher took us to Blue Whistle, and we had like a whole like cultural experience there, and like with live music and jazz and stuff. And we got to meet a lot of leaders of, of the liberation movement. They got to come in and share their experiences um, and kind of changing the, the country. We've also gotten to really know the women that work with us from Beyond Sports and we've gotten to eat at uh, their family home and try real home cooked meals and Mario has taken us to a couple of restaurants around Heidveld and we've gotten to try food that we would not have gotten to try otherwise and I think that that has been really cool for all of us. And then also having experiences like going to the Cape Town City FC Kaiser Chiefs game and just experiencing nightlife here. It's a very lively uh, place to be and um, you know I've really enjoyed it. And the beaches are awesome too, so that's nice. I would definitely recommend anybody who is interested in, you know, working with kids and, and being able to help develop a, a non-governmental organization. GCU has been an incredible experience, and if you're really looking to have an, an impact on a great program and a great community, I would definitely recommend working with GCU. Yeah, I would absolutely recommend uh, coming to Cape Town to to anyone, whether it be through a study abroad program or, or just travel and 
general. I think it's a place that everyone should experience, um, and it's it's a really you know they call South Africa the Rainbow Nation, and it really is that um, you know an opportunity to get to see and meet people from a wide variety of backgrounds and uh, have many new experiences. I would definitely recommend others to do this. I think it's a once in a lifetime opportunity. If you can do it, I'd say do it. I would not hold anything back and just completely go for it. You are you next. All right, all right. You got next.